Welcome to the Village Girl channel. Since it is very hard to find um, tasty fries in the village, I like to make fries at home. So um, today I am making uh, potato, uh, butter potato wedges. And once I have sliced my potatoes into wedges, I put them on a baking sheet and added uh, butter and salt. You can melt the butter so that it spreads evenly on all the wedges, but I was in such a hurry, so I just decided to spread the butter as it was. Once you have spread the butter and the salt on all the wedges, throw in a, uh, fresh cloves of garlic. You may halve them so that uh, they, they give off their aroma well. Or you can decide to cook them as whole cloves. It is your choice. I chose to halve mine. Uh, once you are, you are done adding the garlic cloves, you can now put them in the oven for baking. Uh, make sure you preheat the oven for 15 minutes at 150 degrees. Then after that, you can put the, the wedges into the oven for baking. Bake for about 25 minutes. Uh, after which you should open the oven and spread your and sprinkle your your rosemary leaves. Uh, uh, once you have spread the rosemary leaves, bake for additional five minutes so that uh, the rosemary can give off its rich aroma. Once you're done, it should pick take about 30 minutes for all the baking and for the wedges to be ready. You can serve them with meat, vegetables or whatever you like. For me today, I just wanted some avocado and tomato sauce. That's just how I wanted my pota uh, butter potato wedges. I hope you enjoy making these wedges at home. Tell me how you it turned out and subscribe for more village recipes and uh, adventures. Thank you for watching.